always say put a pebble on the ground and people are not pumped all the time. Put a pebble in a stroller, forget it. Kids, old ladies, grab them by the face and kiss them on the mouth. People will cross the street towards us, and if you know any pit bull owners, it's very rare that people come towards you as opposed to move away from you. Okay, so we have fun little mayor in Brooklyn. Happy birthday to you! He got cancer again. His back legs barely work anymore. So we we're basically told keep him comfortable and we'll see. All of the health stuff's catching up to him. So I decided it would be a fun thing to make sure that instead of being sad and worried about losing him, that we would enjoy the time we had together. She had a dog as a kid, either had Colin. We would only adopt her at this point. There's no reason not to. They're great. There's so many of them, and that's how we got her. <laughs> The first day we brought her into her house, she was obsessed with Tempo. We had pictures of the first week where Tempo would be laying somewhere and she came and just laid on top of him. Laika basically is attached to Tempo at the hip. She wants to be doing whatever he's doing, she's interested in whatever he's interested in. Whatever part of the couch that he's on, she wants to basically be a part of him in some way, wrap herself around him. She's obsessed with him, she loves him so much. He's definitely her favorite person. She is kind of like a warm security blanket. She's always with him. We're strolling, she's next to him. He's always himself, he's always happy, he's always comfortable. Chemo and stuff like that, he's had some rough days, but all in all, he's still very sensitive and sweet, intuitive. He's a champ. I don't think that most people go through what he went through and still be the happy dog that he is. 